Good morning, Wildcat Kindergarten and First Graders. Here we are at Miss Robin's house. And today, our art lesson and what we're gonna talk about is Native American culture and art. Native Americans were the first ones to live here a long, long time ago. And this time of year, I always think about them because of Thanksgiving and different things about harvests and ceremonies and holidays that we have. And maybe you're thinking about them too. If you hear in the background, see if you can hear the Native American flute that Miss Robin is playing for you. I hope that you can hear it. Today we're going to talk a little bit about color. That's what you've been working on at school as you've created and learned lots of things and how to communicate with art um, in the art studio. But we're going to talk about corn. Corn um, is a Native American symbol for harvest. They used it for lots of different things. And today you might see it around as a decoration, as a piece of visual art um, to celebrate this harvest time of the year. We've talked about how different times of the year um, we have different visual art and things look different around us. And I want you to be aware of that as we go um, through the different seasons. I want to show you my corn here. I have corn stalks on my porch. I always do that. And this is some hard shell corn. Now, this is not Native American Indian corn or what they, another word is called flint. That has many colors. And today's art project is going to be to make a piece of corn or something that looks like a piece of corn that celebrates harvest time, but also reminds you of the color groups that we've learned at school. Remember the primary colors? What are those? You might do a little clapping game to help you remember. How about the secondary colors? How do you make those? Tell somebody in your family. Well, today you are going to get a piece of paper. You are going to cut out a shape like this. This is just one big oval shape. And then I cut out some tassels at the top and glued them on. I know that kindergarten and first grade artists totally can do this. I want you to divide your corn into lots of squares like that by drawing lines. You can see I did mine. And then use the primary colors, red, yellow, and blue, and the secondary colors, purple, orange, and green, to color in all of those squares and make it look like some Native American Indian corn. And then think about how that represents harvest at this time of year. I hope you're having a great time learning at home. Don't forget to listen to the story about the Indian paintbrush. Learn to do the powwow dance. And also watch the video about Native American culture so you can learn a little bit about um, that culture. I hope you're having fun learning and creating at home. Bye kindergartners. Bye first graders. Remember, always speak joy. Have a great week.